It was supposed to be a clash between two teams near the bottom of the Eastern Conference standings on Friday. It turned into one of the most statistically absurd NBA games in years. After four overtimes and 68 minutes of play overall, the Chicago Bulls outlasted the Atlanta Hawks by a score of 168-161 to to win the third-highest scoring game in NBA history. The only NBA games with a higher total, assuming you don't count All-Star games, a triple over Time Pistons Nuggets clash in 1983 with a score of 186 to 184 and another triple overtime game between the Spurs and Bucks in 1982 that ended 171 to 166. It was a war of attrition between two teams that are basically jockeying for draft position at this point in the season. 15 different players topped 30 minutes on the floor. One of them was the 42-year-old Vince Carter, whose 44 minutes marked his highest total since 2012. 42-year-old Vince Carter played 44 to 53, Otto Porter Jr., I was talking to him and said, how in the heck are you still out here, man, he was like, I don't even know, he said his legs were numb and he couldn't feel them. But that's like Superman out there. I'm a big fan, KC. Johnson, at Casey Joe, March 2, 2019 The funniest part, these two teams play each other again in two days on Sunday. Zach Levine leads way for Bulls naturally, it was a game of abundant stats. Both teams posted their franchise record for scoring in a single game, and 14 players scored in double digits. The Bulls were led by 47 points, 9 rebounds and 9 assists from Zach Levine. He saved some of his best work for overtime. Also getting in on the action was Otto Porter, who sure has looked like what the Bulls needed when they traded for the forward in a deadline deal with the Washington Wizards. He had 31 points and 10 rebounds while making a team-high 7 three-pointers. Laurie Markkinen also continued a 10-game streak of at least 20 points and 9 rebounds, posting 31-17 and 17 on Friday. All three were strong performances. And yet, the most impressive one might have been on the losing side. Trey Young enters incredible statistical territory for a rookie until this game hit comical scoring territory, it very much looked like Young's biggest breakout game yet. The fifth overall pick in last year's NBA draft entered Friday having posted a career-high 36 points in back-to-back -back games. Then, Young posted 49 points on 17 of 33 shooting, 6 of 13 from deep with 16 assists and 8 rebounds. Over his last five games, the 20-year-old is averaging 34.8 points and 10.4 assists. It's worth pointing out that Young also faded a bit near the end and posted a career-high nine turnovers, but that's not unreasonable to expect from a rookie playing 56 minutes in a single game. Even with those negatives, Young has entered rare territory for a rookie. Trey Young might have shined brighter than any player on either team in the Hawks' quadruple overtime loss to the Bulls. Photo by Scott Cunningham, NBA E via Getty Images, here's a quick roundup of some milestones Young hit Friday. You're about to see the names of a bunch of NBA Hall of Famers. Four rookies in the last 40 years have scored 30 points in three consecutive games. Michael Jordan, David Robinson, Allen Iverson and Trey Young, Pick.twitter.com slash Bevs2SPNS, Yahoo Sports NBA, at Yahoo Sports NBA, March 2, 2019 Trey Young is just the fourth rookie since the ABBA NBA merger to score 35 or more points in at least three straight games. The others are Bernard King, Michael Jordan, and Allen Iverson, Justin Cabaco, at Jay Cabaco, March 2, 2019 End of the first overtime, Trey Young now has 45 points, 12 assists, and 5 revs. Per at bball underscore ref, he's just the fourth rookie in NBA history with at least 40 points, 10 assists, and 5 reps in a game. The other three players in this exclusive club are Oscar Robertson, MJ and LeBron, Tommy Beer, at Tommy Beer, March 2, 2019 Those numbers don't mean Young should definitely start packing for Springfield, Massachusetts, but maybe the Hawks really did know what they were doing when they traded for the Oklahoma freshman. More from Yahoo Sports